Hello, welcome back to TG TV, and more specifically, welcome back to the M1. We're on the M1, right? Um, yes. This is my twin brother. For those new to the channel, say hello. Oh, hi there. Hello. Hi, yeah. Do you want to do it nicely and normally? Oh, good afternoon. It's not. It's morning, isn't it? So we're live. But anyway, yeah. It doesn't matter. Hi there. Hi everyone that doesn't know who I am. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Cut, cut the nonsense. He is off to go and get his new daily today. This car has been a long time coming. Hands on the wheel. This car has been a long time coming, has it not? It has been a very long time coming, and that's typical JE fashion, really. I like to faff and waste time and annoy you on a group, so yeah, that's fine. Pontificating for a number of months, so, so, so. Again, for those new to the channel, you already have a Turbo S in the garage? I do. Wonderful. It's on the channel not long ago. Actually. The world's loudest Turbo S, the world's best modified Turbo S. All lots, of them. All of lots of uh, superlative clickbait titles there. So then, you have been uh, pontificating about this daily driver for a number of months now, and the day has finally come to get the car. It's taken a little while longer than normal. You've had some work done to it, some amazing work done to the car, yep. pre-delivery, and we're gonna go into that. But right now, we're off to Urban Automotive, which you were there a little while ago picking up your Turbo S. Yep. Many of you will be familiar with Urban Automotive. So this car then is not just, it's not really just a car, is it? It's kind of a, it's kind of something you've wanted for a while. It's kind of like a dream car, and something you've been working your socks off for, for the past, well, years and years and years, but specifically the past few months have been really, really busy for you. You've literally yeah. been working to early hours every single day, working on an LDNM launch on the 1st of January. Yeah. That launch is going to be huge. As I say, it's coming on the 1st of January, and LDNM is a, uh, well, it's the UK's best fitness company. I'll leave the link below. But you've been working flat out around the clock, and this is kind of like a culmination of just all those efforts, and it, it means more to you than just a car, safe to say? Yeah, so much more. And it's the reason why I can, you know, carry on. People always say, oh, why do you work so late and stuff? But if you've got something to aim towards, then it makes yeah. it worthwhile. So it's, it's kind of like, I would say a treat, but it's not really a treat. It's kind of like a reward almost like. It's well deserved basically. And I, I don't, I genuinely, I look lazy in comparison to this guy. He's just working around the clock and um, yeah, I'm really, really pleased for you. So I'm excited on a personal level to go and get the car. And I think without further emotional waffle, <laughs> I think it's time to go and, well, yeah, I'm excited. we need to get there first. Yeah, we got halfway with that dive, so that's a start. <laughs> We're in the 996 as well, so anything can happen at this point. Do you know what's quite nice as well? Just one other thing, just to waste more time on the video, but it's nice to be able to collect it as well, because obviously Tom and I, we own London Muscle together, but we don't say a huge amount of each other. So it's nice no. to be able to share these experiences yeah. and kind of enjoy the moment together. And you didn't actually make it to my Turbo S collection, so it's about time. Boy, boy. No, we, we kind of, we, we do mess up each other's schedules quite a lot and uh, we miss each other on a lot of these things because we're both just flat out. So it is actually quite nice to get, it's nice. get a car together. And um, hi mum, we're doing a video together. Watching. She will be. She watches all of them. Yeah, yeah. She likes it. She likes it. She's yeah. already um, critiqued last night's video via WhatsApp to me. Locker. <laughs> Not again. Yeah. All right. Let's get to the dealership. Let's go. Right then you lot, I have arrived at Urban Automotive and it's actually quite cool because I did go to the last unit and I haven't been to their new one. This is a, how many square foot? Uh, Lenny's like, here by the way. About 37,000. 37,000 square foot unit. It's absolutely enormous and there's some really, really cool stuff. Actually, I'll just want to show you this. This is really cool. This is the entire timeline of Urban vehicles. So you've got Defender, Sport, Vogue, Velar, Discovery, Bentayga, and G-Wagon right there. All with urban uh, accoutrements on them. Right, let's go around here anyway. See the customization options. <laughs> We've got a whole load of little... Uh, accoutrements. Accoutrements. Is that the right word? 
Uh, Lenny, you're, you're half French, are you not? Sounds good to me, mate. Sounds good to me. Perfect. We've got different paints here to choose from. Various wheel options, various uh, centre cap options there. I mean, you can you probably tell what they all are by me just pointing at them. I don't even need to tell you. Stitching options, leather options. We've got a load of Defender bits here as well. So you've got Defender, Urban can fully, fully kit. I've actually got this exact unit in my Defender. These are actually... I have an Urban Defender, Lenny. I still have it. I know, I know. And you love it. It's one of your favourite cars. These are actually um, colour samples for what you can have on your Voss and wheels. Ah. So we've ordered those for your uh, 996, which I think you're in a three spoke, which I think would look lovely. I don't think it would, Lenny. Oh, the 906 is outside, but you, you terrorised on the way in. Thank you for that. And going around with more Defender bits here. If you're a Defender man, you'll recognise what all those bits are for. And um, more Voss and Wheels. Urban are an authorised supplier of Voss and Wheels. Loads of punchy bits. And you're nearer here as well, catering for Lamborghinis and kind of the high, high, high end uh, carbon bits and bobs. I've become very distracted there. Apologies about that. I think it's time just to get the covers off. Do we think it's time to get the covers off? Absolutely. Yep. Oh. Dean's here as well. Oh. High five. It's Christmas. There we go. Well, by the time they watch this, it's Boxing Day. So, have we got any Christmas wishes? Lots of Christmas wishes, but James has got the best Christmas present without a doubt. Yes. Come on, boys. Absolutely. Come on, then. Let's go. Wonderful time. <laughs> Lenny has been uh, insistent that I don't see it until the cover comes off. Yeah, this is a surprise for you. Yeah, I mean, I know what I've bought, but it's had a lot of stuff done here. We'll go into that in more detail. Here we go. There's some mental stock here, so I'm going to go and look at this in a sec. Oh my god. Hello. Lenny's smiling. The, the smile of a salesman that's seen his next victim yeah. over there. <laughs> I can almost see them above your head. Right, should we, should we do this then? Are we ready? <laughs> what was that? Are you done? What is going on? You don't want to know what's going on. Okay, I'm going to count down from three. Three, two, one. <laughs> So here we go then, this is JE's brand new daily. It is a Range Rover Vogue long wheelbase and it's actually had a load of uh, bits and bobs done to it. And many of you that follow James on Instagram will know exactly what rig means. Well done on the number plate first and foremost. Are you happy boy? That looks absolutely incredible. All the chrome has been removed. 22 inch turbine wheels, these are OEM Land Rover turbine wheels. However, uh, we've had them refurbed in a uh, gloss black with a, a smoked diamond finish over the top. So that's really, really not. That is cool, actually. So we've, back we've, there is darker. James made the, a, a great decision of instead of all black, that sort of breaks it up nicely. It still looks murdered out, but you've got that. that yeah, finish it's really, diamond. really cool finish on there. So you got updated rear lights, privacy glass all the way around. It is autobiography, so it's top, top spec. Come around then, everything is dechromed. And signifying the fact it is a long wheelbase, we've got the little L there. One thing I would say though, I, I mean you can see that there, that is not a mirror, that is the paintwork. So Urban Detailing here have done an amazing, amazing job. I don't think I've seen anything this shot. That is literally a mirror. Here comes JE. Hello sir. So these are the same guys that obviously did the Turbo S and I decided to use them again. And it's not a freebie, it's not a handout. I decided to use them because of the work you can, you can, the Turbo S. Uh, if, you, if you look at that, then it looks like you're looking at the camera. No, yeah, chaos. Yeah, it's mad. It's crazy. So it's had a full detail and ceramic coat, and this car obviously isn't brand new as well, yet the paint works better than it left the factory. I can see Lenny up there as well. It's crazy. Unbelievable. So Chaos. Come around the front, you've got a black grill, so it's and SB, these little badges as well. SB Autobiography style grill. Yeah, uh, that's we've cash. Done, we've blacked out everything, even this has been painted. Oh, amazing. Um, all these have been blacked out, all this was blacked out. Yeah, yeah, updated grill. Wow. Even the, uh, the side vents, your, your keen viewers that have got land by knowledge will know that these are 2018 model year side fins as well. So really? These have, been, these have been updated as well. Oh, oh wow. That's so usually, usually you've got a three there. This is a four of the 2018 model. Ah. So from this, from this angle, it is 2018 onwards. So yeah, really, really cool. It's a big old boy. Look at that, sorry, the size no, of that no, rear sorry, door. Sorry, sorry, I should have, I should have, uh, <laughs> sir. <laughs> oh. Before I get in. Okay. <laughs> the most mesmerising thing of all. How do they do that to carpets? I don't they brush it the other way, don't they? It's like a football pitch. So you brush it one way and then... Yeah, I don't get that either. 
and you've got TVs in the back here. One thing I want to say, look at the size of that door. Um, it's like the size of my front room, that do door. It, but there's blinds in there somewhere as well. I don't know how you work them, but there's... There's blinds anyway, so whoever Jay is transporting around is uh, having a nice time back there. Stand on the mop, oh, oh, that's Have you got a fridge in there, boy? Talk us through that. Here, lad. What's that? I don't know, is that a fridge? What are you got in there, boy? You got any snacks? Oh, no, just one second. Excuse me. I'll be back in a minute. I mean, he's supposed to be driving this back. <laughs> so the car is now outside and it has looked... This is boshing it out, yeah? This is, this is boshing it out. No, yeah. turning. The end, turning of, the the end of this video, we're just going to bosh it out quickly. Okay, so basically the, how the car turned out, it started life looking very, very different. Might put up some photos of that, actually. Don't know. But anyway, Mr. DMB Collection, Dean Bartle here, sourced me the car. Hello, it Dean. It is a okay. rare, very, very, very low mileage, long wheelbase. So he is a, g a gem for finding that car for me. A nice buying process, smooth, blah, 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 usual stuff. So DMB collection in the mix. And then obviously Lenny here, I wanted to customize how it looked. I sorted out some mm. parts and these guys here fitted it, did a load of work on the car. Windows were done, the lot, and then obviously the detailing where the paintwork looks better than any car I've ever had, including brand new cars. What's been done to the paintwork, James? Full paint correction, so all the swells yeah. taken out, light scratches and then ceramic coated, which is good because they apply it properly for a number of years <laughs> rather than washing off at the next car wash. Perfect. Did you like that? I yeah. didn't have a script either. Fully boshed out. Yeah. Is that Fully. anything else? Like, oh, everything that. Every, everything oh. ticked. Amazing. Oh, actually, I do want to say one, one thing. Gav and Luke, who did my car, who are the detailers here, absolutely incredible. Like, kept me updated the whole way through. And that's genuine. That's not me plugging anything. They are so professional and good. So thank you very much for that. And have a good Christmas. It's already been Christmas. Okay, well, I don't understand when the video's going live. Leave it alone. <laughs> <laughs> we hope you had a good Christmas. Yeah. So there we go. Lenny's got it. Pa past tense. Yes. Yeah. Okay, I think that's pretty much it now. Thank you so much for watching. Do subscribe, blah, blah, blah. And I hope you had a lovely Christmas, everyone. Bye-bye yeah, now.